Do you guys do this exercise in your dance class with your buddies where you throw with all of your might to help your dancer friend find her core? I have a better suggestion. So before you move on, make sure you subscribe, hit the bell button so you're getting all of these tips because this exercise can be good, but it could go so wrong. So let's figure out how to make this better. Now, the first thing that we wanna look at is actually me, the standing partner. It is not my job to throw her legs with all of the passion that I have inside of me to the floor if she cannot control her body. This is a core exercise. So we wanna see that the rib cage drops down, that your low back stays on the ground if she brings this arm up here so you can see. What happens so often is the low back will lift up off of the floor, the flare, ribs will flare, and it really bothers the back. I must see that the ribs stay down, the low back stays flat, and the shoulders stay controlled. This might mean that her legs only come to about here. That is okay, because if she's truly getting core engagement and work, that's what we wanna see. You can progress the exercise from there. Now, <clears throat> when you're in this position, I wanna make sure that you're feeling the best. I have actually heard this from several dancers that as they do this exercise, they feel pins and needles, they feel numbness, they feel discomfort through their back and legs. Those are all things that are not good. And that can come from the back lifting up, creating pinching through the spine, the nerves, the muscles. We should not have any of those sensations. You should feel some core support. You should feel the size of your body as you do this. So as we do this correctly and we look back at the whole angle of this, I am asking my partner, is this too much? Is this too little? As I push, she's gonna let her legs only go as far as she can, keeping the control and low back pushed on the floor. Her shoulders are down, her ribs are down, and now we have a core exercise that is actually gonna help you make some progress in our strength. I have other exercises like this and others that can assist you with your technique, with your strength, and figuring out how we put these exercises as cross training into your work in the studio. Make sure you subscribe and you can also check me out at alignfitnessbyally.com.